podcast. Yes, I have uh, recently. I I've joined a podcast in S Channel. Mm-hmm. Okay, what's it's, the name? What's the name of your podcast? S Channel. Okay, um, S Channel or what? Sorry, what is that? S S Channel. It's like S. Oh, S S Channel. S Channel. Okay, I get it. S Channel. Okay, yeah, super. Yeah. Super. And what, what's your what's your interest in fitness? I, I I'm I'm just uh, talk, uh, want to talk about what uh, uh, what kind of advice you give for overweight people. Um. Well, the the question is why is a person overweight? I mean, before you can give advice, you need to get some background information. Like when someone says, "I want to buy a car," it's like, "Okay, why do you want to buy a car?" Right? So, um, okay. So, so why why is uh, do you know why this person is overweight? Uh, I think overeating. <laughs> Overeating. Okay. Well, that's normally why people are overweight because they overeat. The question is, why do they overeat? Yeah, maybe. Well, no. People people are fat because they eat too much, right? Right. <laughs> right. So the question is, <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Right. Yeah, you are oh, absolutely oh, right. <laughs> oh, okay. So the question is, why do they eat too much? Why? So, uh, well, why do they eat too much? Because, because there's no point saying you need to do this and you need to do that no. and you need to do these exercises if the person doesn't know why they're eating too much. So, um, so why does um, is it is this specifically for you or is it for a friend or somebody is else? It for, uh, is it for friend? It's for a friend. Okay, super. Right. So, um, this person, this friend, why do they eat so much? <laughs> I have no idea why they eat so much. <laughs> okay, but you are their friend, right? Yeah. Right. You're their friend, so you know them, yeah? Yeah, right. I know. Okay, so, so how long have you known them? Like uh, years, five years, ten years, six months, yeah. long time? Long time? Uh, she is my, she is my uh, school friend. Okay, and school friend. Yeah. Okay, right. So, school friend. Okay, super cool. So, um, can I ask how old this person is? Because age affects, you know, exercise and weight and stuff. So, how old uh, is okay. the person? Twenty-five. Uh, Twenty-five. Okay, right. So, um, does this person come from a family where people are, where other people are big or overweight in their family? Uh, some of uh, some members of uh, her family are fat, you know. Um, mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> Good, healthy, healthier family. Okay, okay, because because if you come from a family where everyone is is big, right? It might not yeah. it might not just be fat. It might be people are just big. Then yeah. you live you live in an environment where. This is normal, right? You live in an environment right. where being big is normal. And if yeah. being big is normal, why do you want to change? Right? <laughs> right. <laughs> because it's a uh, generation uh, demand, you know. It's a mm-hmm. fashion demand. It's co- you can say it's fashion demand or uh, generation demand or... Uh, mm-hmm. or uh, at least... I, uh, what can I say? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Let me um, um, let me think about this. So, um, the place where you live is very important, right? Your home is very important. Your environment is very important. And oh, if, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And um, this defines your your lifestyle. This defines your habits. And if you live with uh, people who are, you know, physically very large or maybe fat or they enjoy eating or people cook really well, right? Because, you know, if people cook good food, it's hard yeah. not, not to eat it, right? right. So, so if you live in that kind of environment, there's not much you can do because, because in that environment, it's normal to be big. So if you want to change your your lifestyle, 
you have to change your environment. You have to change the things that are around about you. Okay. And uh, and this is this, this this is not an easy thing to do because usually we are all quite comfortable, especially with our families, especially with our friends, and um, and and change is difficult. Now, there's only three things that you can change in the world around about you. Three things: you can change time. You can change place and you can change people, right? So right. T time, you can't control time, right? Time changes, but you can't control it. Yeah? Never. Never. Yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah. I, without a time machine, and I don't think time machines exist. So, <laughs> so, yeah, but, yeah. But, but, but time is important because, you know, if you start an exercise program or something like that, you know, it, it doesn't happen instantly that you look great or you feel great. It takes time. It takes three months, six months, one year, maybe three years, maybe five years. I can tell you from personal experience, I was I was overweight, right? Really? About, yeah, yeah, I was overweight about, uh, let's see, when, when was it exactly? Um, my son was born eight years ago, right? My son was born okay. eight years ago. When he was born, I was overweight. Eight years. Yeah, oh. eight Eight years ago, I was when he was born. I was overweight, and I decided this is not good. It's not good for me to be fat. This is not good for me to be. I, I'm not a positive yeah. image for my son. I need to change something. Yeah. And I told myself I need to change something. I need to do something about this. I need to work on myself. And I told okay. myself I told myself that every day for three years. I told myself that every day for three years, and you know what changed? Nothing. What? Nothing, nothing, absolutely nothing, absolutely nothing changed <laughs> because I didn't because I didn't do anything. All I was doing was was just Aww. thinking. All I was doing was thinking about changing. I wasn't acting on that change. And I, I, I and I, I told myself like I have to do something. I have to do something. I have to do something. And it took three <laughs> this years. is the main problem, you know, it is the main yeah. problem. I have mm. to do, I have to do, but nothing mm. can happen. <laughs> yeah, 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 I told myself it's like I, I woke up every morning and I thought I know that I have to do. I you know I know I have to do this or I know I have to um, I don't know, eat less food or maybe drink less beer or take more exercise or go to the swimming pool or go to the yeah. gym or buy some jogging shoes and walk up a hill or something. I told myself that for every day for three years and nothing changed. Nothing. <laughs> now, no. now, what, now what the, right now, what is your right? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> right now. I am uh, right now. I'm 43 years old, and I'm the healthiest okay. and fittest that I have ever been in my life. Okay, and the change wow. happened five years ago. Uh, the change nice. happened five, yeah. five five years ago because okay. fi because finally I start finally I, I bought some <laughs> shoes. I put on a pair of shorts, and you know what I did? I yeah. started walking. I walking. started. By Walking, I told myself I'm gonna w I'm gonna go out in the morning and I'm gonna walk for ten. Okay. Minutes. And I said I'm gonna walk for fifteen minutes, and I said I'm gonna walk for twenty minutes, and I said I'm gonna walk for thirty minutes, and then I changed my walk into uh, ten steps walking, ten steps jogging. Then I said twenty steps walking, twenty steps jogging, and and I did this a little bit every single day. Okay. And and finally, slowly, very, very slowly, little bit by little bit, I started to lose weight. I started to eat more healthy. I started to go out more. I started to um, think about exactly what I was eating, when I was eating. I started to think about sleeping patterns and how to sleep. Wow. Um, <laughs> you know, I was, I was so fat that I was scared to go to the swimming pool. Right, I was right. I was afraid to go to the swimming pool because I was embarrassed. I was embarrassed to take my clothes off and have other people see these, see me not <laughs> not, not not look not looking good. And I thought, and I thought this 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 is this is terrible because my I, I I have to be a good example for for my kids. Right, I have to be a good right. example. I 
have to be a better example. Hello, Graham. And um, and it's it's Hello. it's. May I know uh, where are you from? Where where am I from? Um, originally I'm from Scotland. Right now I'm in Slovakia, right in the heart of Europe, in a town called Banská Bystrica. Ah. Oh. Right now I'm oh, right I'm, in the I'm from, from Bangladesh, Dhaka. Okay. Yeah, that's 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 Okay, tell me, more about where you, tell me more about where you. Tell me more about where you are, because I don't know anything about that part of the world. So, so, you know, what? what really? Is it? Yeah, I don't. <laughs> I don't know, right? <laughs> no, nah. Educate me. I'm from Bang. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it, <laughs> educate me. Tell me something about the place where you are. Oh, I educated you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm uh, Bangladesh. Um, uh, the, uh, the capital city of Bangladesh is Dhaka, and I am from Dhaka, and a uh, very small country, but I'm proud of my country because uh, we achieved this country by uh, by very, very, what I can say, we uh, fight for our country, you know, in 1971, uh, we fight against uh, Pakistan. Mm -hmm. Then, mm -hmm. then we achieve our country because they ruled our country. Mm -hmm. they, uh, Pakistan, they ruled our country. Uh, you heard about this ever? Um, my knowledge of history is like I know you, but I know about European history. I know about British history. I know about American history, but okay, I, okay. I, I don't know about the history of Bangladesh. I'm sorry. I just it's just, <laughs> no, it's. It's absolutely okay. <laughs> Not here, but I, I, I'm. Um, and we speak uh, Bangla also. Uh, can I share some word with you in Bangla? Please, please do it. Yes. Ami, ami, apnar kotha khub pochundo korechi. Do you know what I say? <laughs> I don't know. What is? I no, no, no idea. What does that mean? I like your suggestion. <laughs> Oh, that's great! That's beautiful! Wow! Wow! So, <laughs> wow! So, um, so where, where are you right now? Like, are you are you are you at home or, or are you yes, somewhere? I'm at home right now. <laughs> okay. okay. So, is that this home like a flat or a house or or what kind of? It's a flat. <laughs> it's, 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 it's a flat. Okay. Uh, with my family, mm -hmm. my mom, mm -hmm. my mom, uh, father, my brothers. Mm -hmm. Oh, did you have a big family? Sorry? Do you have a big family? Uh, in Bangladesh culture, uh, we all live with, uh, live together. You know? oh, okay. <laughs> well, that's, that, that's good. That, that, that's good because everybody can help everybody, right? Yeah, right. It's a very big supportive, you know. Support uh, means everything. Mm -hmm. When you, oh, I, uh, you can, uh, you can ask any member of your family to ask for help. Mm -hmm. that, that, that's great because, um, because everybody, every, everybody knows everybody, everybody is there for them. I, I like that element of culture when family is together. Thank you. <laughs> it's, Thank it's, you. It's really it nice. Mm -hmm. I think it only happens in, uh, uh, in Bangladesh or Asia countries, uh, uh, family, you know, they uh, like to uh, live with the family and uh, they are seeking for family love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. And you learn, you learn a lot when you live with your family. And I'll tell you why, right. because, because you can choose your friends, but you can't mm -hmm. choose your family, right? Right. Yeah. You can, and you learn a lot when you live together with your family because right. you have to. Cause you have to. The difficult yes. situations you have to live with and uh, you, you learn from, from these problems, from these difficult situations that you have to go through. Definitely. Yes. Definitely. Okay, super. So um, the question was about fitness. So I hope that I was able to give you maybe a little bit of positive advice there about what, what a person can do. So start, with little, start with little things. Start with little things. Just start with something. Start with something little. Yeah. Don't expect yeah. too much. You know, just five, just five minutes a day, and it doesn't happen quickly. Yeah. Right? Okay. 
it's this 